Hi guys, got another build for you here. This time we're still continuing with the Swator builds for leveling um, for the 1.4 patch. This one is for the Jedi Counselor and the advanced class we're going to cover is the Shadow. Um, it's actually a kinetic combat build because that's the main tree that we're using. And we're using a few skills from the balance tree and leaving infiltration totally. And I'll give you some rotations and stuff that you can use with the build. So, as always, let's start. Um, you want to put three on technique mastery. You want to move across here and stick two on double bladed saber defense. Stick two on applied force. Then you want to move up here, just put one on expertise. Uh, stick two on elusiveness. Stick two on rapid recovery. Okay. Um, Moving up, you want to put two on Shadow Sight. Then you want to pick up Kinetic Ward, pick up Mind Over Matter, and pick up Particle Acceleration. And then moving up, you want to put three on one with the Force. Um, move up again and pick up Force Pull. Uh, pick up Stasis and pick up Bombardment. Then you want to move back down here and stick two points on impact control. And then moving up, stick three points on force break, two on harness shadows, and pick up slow time at the top. So that's your main kinetic combat tree. Um, moving across, as I say, we're not bothering with infiltration for this build. And uh, moving across here, you want to put three on force energy in the balance tree. You want to stick two on Jedi Resistance. You want to stick two on Psychokinesis. And you want to stick three on Upheaval. And that sh that's your ten points in balance. And you should have a level 50 build once you've done all that. Now, for some rotations and, and stuff that you can... Um, well, yeah, basically rotations and survivability options you've got. Uh, you've got Kinetic Ward. This is for single targets. Starting off with Kinetic Ward, Slow Time, Force Breach, Telekinetic Throw, Spinning Strike, Project, Double Strike and Saber Strike. For multiple targets you could do um, Slow Time, Force Breach and um, force potency and you've got some survivability options as well your main survivability skills are battle readiness force cloak deflection and force of will so um, there you have it give it a go let me know what you think and i will keep the builds coming cheers guys